They create an interactive Israel experience for the opportunity to participate in the Jewish Federation of North America National Winter Family Mission to Israel. GFNA represents 154 Jewish Federation and 300 network communities, raising collectively over $900 million for projects in Israel and 70 countries around the globe. GFNA mission is rooted in community building, issue development, and fundraising. And when you come to Israel, you'll take pictures and video, but how do you get it to be interactive? GFNA partnered with the Eye Center to launch the first ever Google Glass integration into a mission. Participants were given Google Glass to tell their story through a unique lens. Google Glass allows users to take pictures and video in real time, create Google Hangouts, and even get directions. Let's take a closer look. Driving in Israel. First one I've actually seen live. Nice to meet you. Hi, Aaron. Nice to meet you. Yeah, yeah, you're on now. We're live. <laughs> Salute. Here we are today, picking oranges, with my friend over there, who has Google Glass also. Hours worth of work can do a lot of good. So we're here at Bay Green, and uh, we're going to dig. You guys are in a good spot. I know. Sorry, yeah. Using Google Glass, you can do this safely and hands free. Hello. What's up? Does it tell me to grab him? My friend on my street got the first like full keyboard. So tell us the best part of your trip. Um, the best part of my trip is I, I actually did Birthright uh, a year and a half ago and just everything was just so different and it was very modern and we got to see things that you like we wouldn't have gotten to see and it's it's, it's just a really eye-opening experience. Go, I think my favorite part though was going to the uh, the Arab house for dinner and just seeing what their culture is like because it's you know, it wasn't like a secret, it was more just like blind. We, I, I just didn't know how things work there. It's really cool. And you use uh, Google Apps just to take a picture. And if it, how was how the experience for you? Um, it was it was pretty cool, pretty easy. Uh, all you gotta say is, okay, Glass, take a picture, and it does it for you. It's really cool. Best part of the experience is probably going to the wall on Friday night. It was such a spiritual moment and every it was just like a holy place. And what I really got out of this trip was that Israel isn't just a religion. It's like there's so much more to it than just black hats and kings. My experience with glass was really great. I think I started out with it at Caesarea, and it was, it was a little tough there because of the glare. But I thought the concept of having basically a miniature computer right in front of your eye is brilliant. Because you can do whatever you want without even moving a finger. Um, the time that really will stick with me probably for the rest of my life was at the Ethiopian um, Absorption Center. Um, I was with little Ethiopian kids who are, don't even remember where they're from, and they're looking at YouTube videos about Ethiopia. And I interviewed with some of them, and when I see it, I'm just gonna remember how touched I felt at that moment. My favorite part of the trip was probably the night when we stayed on the kibbutz. Um, the, when we went and saw the man named Menachem, and he uh, taught us a lot about the life of the ancient Jews. Um, 
And I think I'm going to take out of this trip that Israel is really an amazing place where the old, uh, the history, and the new, you know, the modern side of, of the world right now come together. Uh, my experience with Google Glass was very cool. Um, I started out on the first day when we were um, at the, it's kind of like an orchard with oranges, and we were picking them for charity. And I had no idea what to expect, really, with Google Glass. It was just such a, a foreign concept, having, you know, an electronic device where you would put glasses. And, um, you know, at first I kind of kept going cross-eyed, trying to see the, the screen. Once I got it, it, it was definitely a really cool thing where you can just say, you know, take a picture, and you don't have to, you know, you can keep doing what you're doing. Like when I was picking oranges, oranges, I just said, okay, you last record a video, and all of a sudden I was recording a video without even moving my hands or, or stop. You know, I didn't have to stop what I was doing. What's your most meaningful moment on the JFK Winter Valley mission? Uh, I think my most meaningful moment would be. Uh when my son Robbie reached the wall. And, you know, obviously this is your, this is your first time in Israel. Yes. Um, and, and this is, uh, you know, you have certain expectations when you come in, you know, to uh, a group experience. Did anything change from, like, when you, you know, first came on the trip to, uh, to now? Yeah, that's a, that's a great question. You know, I think um, an expectation of that um, the people would be thinking more about the peace negotiations going on. But in reality, a lot of them are thinking about the struggles they have in everyday life. You know, food on the table or uh, changing things in society. Uh, I think the word I would describe is real, it's a lot more dynamic than I really thought it was. And uh, I have a much better appreciation of what their struggles are. Uh, in some cases, are somewhat similar to some of the everyday struggles we have in the United States. I say that with the context without, without talking about the uh, peace negotiations. And you had a chance to use Google Glass uh, on the trip. How was the experience for you? Yeah, I think Google Glass is great. I think it's yours? the reason why is that you know, sometimes when you're looking at something using glass, you can start speaking whatever your emotion is. The phones okay, are reaching for a uh, camera or a cell phone to then capture that moment, the moment's already gone. So I think Google Glass provides a real connection to whatever you're looking at, expressing what you're feeling with that visual connection. Uh, pretty amazing. As you can see, Google Glass is a wonderful tool to enhance your Israel experience. This is Aaron Herman. Thanks for watching.